Peace, y'all. Slade Almighty, a.k.a. the Global Dawson Ambassador, man. With another Rikers Island story. This story is about how I found out my friend at the time, if I could even call him a friend. Like, he from my block. He from my building. You know what I'm saying? Um, And I realize now at 30 that when you young, you 15, 16, 17, you assume because you grew up with people that they supposed to be your day one, your road dog. You don't understand that as you separate from certain people and you gravitate towards other people later in life, these people are people you have way more esteem and respect for and be more proud to call these people your friends. You dig? But I'm going to get into the story, man. This is 2008. I just got to Rikers Island. Um, it was known... It was, a, I was, I had already known that there was a guy who I did consider my friend at the time, you know, for the simple reason that we used from the same block, you know, um, um, there wasn't no beef, you know, we, we, we associated with each other, you know, you no know, dudes in the hood, you know, doing stupid stuff together, smoking weed together, robbing people together. You know, getting chicks together, you know, stuff that is important to you when you 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 years old. But um, I get to Rikers Island. I get to Rikers Island. Like I said, I went through it my first couple days, you know what I'm saying? They was spanking me, sidelining me, sidelining me, jumping me all crazy. You know what I'm saying? I ain't really know nobody. Yes, you know what I'm saying? I'm from a well-known neighborhood. But when I first got there, you know what I'm saying, the dudes that ran the house was from Brooklyn. They didn't care about nobody from Cortland, nobody associated with anything from Cortland. It's like, are you blood? No? Okay. Can anybody vouch for you? No? Okay, so be with it. I want your commissary. I want phone calls from you. And you got to sit in the back on that iron horse. You know what I'm saying? Otherwise, we're going to spank you. So, you know, I chose to be spanked. <laughs> you feel me? So I'm going through it. But at the same time, I'm like, yo, where's bro at from the hood? I'm not seeing him nowhere. It's like I'm going to law library, not seeing him. I'm going to the visiting floor. You know what I mean? Our last names would, would, would clarify us to have visits on the same day. Don't see him. I'm calling back to the hood. I'm like, yo, is such and such home yet? They're like, nah, he's still in the floor building with you. You know what I'm saying? He talking about he great and, and he running things and he doing whatever he want, blah, 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 blah. I'm like, well, I don't see him. <laughs> Where he at? You know what I'm saying? Maybe he can speak to somebody and keep me from getting jumped the next three days straight like I've been doing. You know what I'm saying? So time goes by. Time goes by, you know, they let up, they let up off me, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, I end up, you know what I'm saying, building up my respect and rapport with the same oppressors that was spanking me, you know, what What else is better to do in jail than get along with people who just, who just stomped you out, right, what else better is there to do in jail, you know what I'm saying, but um, I'm, I'm living in my own right, you feel me, now I'm Gucci now. Now I'm Gucci now, and I'm thinking about bro less. But in the back of my mind, I'm like, yo, where is he? <laughs> I'm like, yo, where is he? And I'm constantly now, slowly but surely, a greater influx of people from calling and people who I know that know this other brother who I'm talking about. And I'm not going to state his name because he's still in the streets trying to be a gangster. Um, He's a blood right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to say his name because, you know what I'm saying, he's a known dude. You know what I'm saying? And he already know that we got our own little personal issues that we're going to deal with when we see each other. Um, um, He's going to have to run the fade. He's going to have to run the fade when he see me. You know what I'm saying? For other little things that went on. You know what I'm saying? Other little things that's irrelevant. You know what I'm saying? Just men. We're going to we gonna have to shake. You know what I'm saying? But, um, but, um, I'm meeting people from the hood, and I'm like, yo, where's, where's bro at? Where's bro, where's bro, where's bro? You know what I'm saying? Um, they like, yo, I don't know. I ain't seen them. I ain't seen them. I ain't seen them. I'm like, yo, that's weird. I'm like, we, I'm like, that's real weird. 
And never in my mind did it occur to me that this dude probably signed into protective custody PC. For those of y'all who don't know what PC is, this is majority for people who are too scared to live in general population. So they sign into protective custody because they don't want no smoke with nobody. Or dudes who they got so much beef that they get signed into PC. You know what I'm saying? By a higher authority figure. You know what I'm saying? Never it occurred to me because where I come from, why would you dare to even do that? <laughs> why would you dare to even do that? You know what I'm saying? Knowing you got to go home. You know what I'm saying? And and deal with that. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? But um, slowly but surely, I run into somebody from Cortland. I don't know if it was... I don't know if it was Bow Wow or somebody else. It was somebody light-skinned. It was somebody light-skinned from the hood. And I'm like, hey, you seen bro? He be like, yo... I did see bro, and, and, and it ain't looking too good for him. I'm like, what? What happened? He got jumped? He got cut? Like, what, like what's up? Like, like, I'm ready to ride. You know what I'm saying? Being that, you know what I'm saying? We got a connection, because he from my block. I'm like, I ain't Big Willie, super gangster, super oppressor, gang member. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But however... I'm cool enough to where I could talk to a CO and get him pulled to the same crib I'm in. At least. At least I could stand up for him in the same house. But bro was like, yo, he not doing too good. I'm like, yo, so what happened? He like, man, listen. I was going to court just the other day and I seen him in the why me pins. Now, as soon as he said the why me pins, I'm like, mm, are you serious? You lying, not my boy. That was another thing that was said very frequently in Rikers Island. When you heard something bad about um, somebody who you know, they'd be like, not my boy. Not my boy. He with it? He a day room dummy? Not my boy. So I'm like, not my boy. He's like, yo, I've seen him in the YME pins. And if you don't know what the YME pins are, these are the pins that they put the soft dudes, the dudes who are in protective custody, they put them in those pens and they call it the why me pens because it's like they in there like why me? Why I gotta be in PC? And now these dudes noticing that I'm in PC. How I'ma live this down, you feel me? Um the why me pens got different meanings, I believe, based on whether you was in C95 or or BMCC, you know what I'm saying, or OBCC. I'm speaking on what the YME pins mean in C74, adolescence, in 2008. You know what I'm saying? Um, but dudes in the YME pins, he signed in the PC. And from that point on, I ain't asked no more questions about it. You know what I'm saying? Um, dude went home, continuing to try to be a gangster um, or try to act like he tough. You know what I'm saying? And, uh... Some, nobody really believes them, but you know, people who still cool with them, they still cool with them. And that's that, you know what I'm saying? That always run me the wrong way. So I never got that close to do, you know what I'm saying? And then things happen in the future where we had a disagreement about some things. And uh, as men, as men, we going to have to shake one day. It's as simple as that, you know what I'm saying? And then it won't be no issues, you know what I'm saying? But that just is what it is. That was my story. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Stay out of jail. You might get snitched on or you might have to snitch or you might have to sign in the PC, man. Peace.